Okay, my, I'm Jos Capito. I'm a Director of Global Performance Vehicles for Ford a Motor Company. And my background is very much a motorsport. I did a lot of motocross and enduro racing when I was young. I did the Perry Dakar Rally four times. And um, I worked for BMW, I worked for Porsche in the race department. And I was uh, also the CEO of the, of the Sauber Formula One team before I joined Ford. Yeah, I think the, the Focus ST, the new one, is the first real global performance vehicles. And it's done with a team in Europe and SVT. So both performance teams are now one performance team. Since one and a half years, we brought the teams together and they're working together. And we found out a lot of synergies. And when you talk about the first, the Focus SVT from 2002, that was a car that was a co-development of exactly the same teams. That was SVT in America and SVE, as it was called at that time in Europe. So we still have the same engineers there in Europe who worked on the Focus SVT, was, called, was already called Focus ST in Europe. And where SVT, you know SVT does the GT500. And the same team is now doing also uh, the Focus ST and involved in that with the European team. And the car is very much developed on the Nordschleife. I think that gets more and more important also for the US vehicles. But when you look at a Focus ST, it already comes with a, with a very, very well equipped. Yeah, it has a, a special, special wheels and it, has, it comes with Recaro seats. You get a lot what you normally would put in the aftermarket. And as you get it right from the beginning with your car as standard, that allows that you can get that all for a very good price because the volume is then there. And then you still have the parts to, to make it really individual, to make it your car. But the base, what you really need for the driver, uh, you know, we focus very much on the, on the seat, on the steering wheel, on the paddles. So you get there already the ultimate. And then you can make with smaller parts and you can, op you can still make it your own car. And we're on rallying, it's smaller cars, it's the B cars, and they're with the Fiesta. We are in rallying, World Rally Championship next year with the Fiesta. We just announced the R2 kit, a special, a special grassroots kit for the Fiesta, where you can do Rally America with in the US. And the Focus, where the, the touring car goes into C car category, so the Focus is the right size to, to, for using touring car. And we have, around the world, we have teams that race the Focus. British Touring Car Championship, Chinese Touring Car Championship, South America. Um, and we brought all these teams together and said, we, forward, we support you to develop a common race car. Yeah, what, what we know so far for, for next year, we know the team who runs the British Touring Car Championship, they will next year run the new Focus. They will be the first one. Then also there is a German team that run uh, the Focus RS on the 24 hour race on the Nürburgring and in the Nürburgring long distance series they also want to run the new Focus. So, and we protect, we got all the different regulations. We base the vehicle on the Super 2000 regulations, but we keep all the options that we have from the various inputs that the car can be easily adapted to the various regulations. And the car you see here is adapted to the, to the American regulations. So very, very production close. Yeah, very close to production that you can race it in US series as well.